hey what is up everyone i hope all of you are doing great and in today's question we have a refractive index mu of atmosphere around a planet varies with altitude or height h according to the equation mu equals mu naught minus kh where mu naught and k are positive constants denoting radius of the planet by r find the altitude at which a point of flashlight spreads around the planet in a spherical layer concentric with the planet in addition to other directions okay uh, let me just uh, tell you the question once again that means for some altitude h if i turn on a flashlight the light will travel a circular path around the earth or the planet okay uh, keeping this point as the center okay uh, i have considered that the thickness of the beam as dh altitude is h here fine and this is how the beam will travel due to this varying refractive index okay now i have just taken a small portion of the beam okay and i zoomed this portion here the variation of the refractive index is uh, n and it increases to n plus dn okay and the thickness is dh as you can see the wave front is something like this okay fine now we need to know one thing that the optical path traveled by all the waves emitting from the wave front will be same that means the optical path of this curve will be equal to the optical path of this curve uh, actually i should say the this wave and this wave will have equal optical paths so what is an optical path optical path is nothing but the product of refractive index and the geometrical path okay so here the refractive index is n and the geometrical path will be r plus h times theta okay so this angle is theta actually this angle is theta will be equal to n plus dn times r plus h plus dh fine so we have n r plus h theta gets cancelled out here will, there will be another theta this theta gets cancelled out uh, we have n times r plus h plus n times dh plus r plus h times dn okay and dn times dh as we know that uh, dn and dh both are very small so we can just ignore this term this two terms gets cancelled out so finally we have n times dh equals minus r plus h times dn okay so we have dn by dh equals minus n divided by r plus h okay and uh, in our question they have already provided n they have written it as mu so n that is also mu equals mu naught minus kh let me see once again yes mu naught minus kh so d mu dh becomes minus k so here we will have minus k equals to minus n as a function of h that would be mu naught minus k h divided by r plus h okay minus gets cancelled out r k plus k h equals mu naught minus k h so 2 k h equals mu naught minus r k so we have h equals to mu naught minus r k divided by 2 k equals half mu naught by k minus r so this is the altitude where if you turn on a flashlight the light will eventually follow a spherical path okay it will just spread out and it will rotate uh, i mean it will follow a spherical path taking this point as the center okay so i hope you have learned a new concept here 
that the optical path uh, of all the waves of a single wave front uh, will be same fine so i hope you all have liked this video and i and i hope you all have found this video helpful and informative please do subscribe if you are new to this channel and please share this video with your friends and teachers and i will see you in the next one peace